Yasas and welcome to GRTV Kitchen. I'm Tina Sophos and we're here at Grecian Scenes Meze Ozeri, Food from the Greek Gods in Carlton North, Nicholson Street. And I'm here in the kitchen with King Menelos, who's going to prepare it for us something very special for Greek Easter. Hi Tina. Hello everyone. Welcome to my kitchen. Tonight we're going to dye some eggs. What colour? These eggs will dye red. That's very traditional for Greek Easter. And also before Easter, we have the fasting period. So something nistissimo for tonight as well? Yes, tonight we're going to uh, make some yemistes. Yemistes piperies, stuffed peppers. Yemistes patates, uh, stuffed potatoes. Yemistes domates, stuffed tomatoes. Wow, that sounds amazing. Let's get cooking. We've got the eggs in the pot now. Meno, how long is it going to take to boil? Okay, now we've got two dozen of eggs in there. They'll take roughly about 45 minutes. 45 minutes? Sounds like a frappe break to me. Yes. And a frappe para calor. Thank you for my frappe. Are the eggs ready now? Yes, the eggs are ready. Now we're ready to dye them. So we add our red dye. And how much red dye do you put? You use a whole sachet uh, of red dye uh, to a cup of water, hot boiling water that is. Make sure that, that the dye is in there. We'll just mix it around so the dye can... And as you can see, when I lift up the egg, it's slowly changing colour. But it's not changing colour very fast. The only way that, the, that these eggs will die and the dye will stick to the egg is by adding a cup of vinegar. Is that just white vinegar? Just white vinegar. If you want the, the eggs to die darker, you can use uh, red wine vinegar. But at this time we've used white vinegar. Now what we need to do is we need to take, take these eggs out of the uh, dye, let them sit for a bit and then we polish them. Oh, is that how we make them shiny? Oh yes. We use a pure olive oil to shine the eggs. Okay, Tina, the eggs are ready for Easter. Oh, beautiful, Menno. Nice and red polished eggs. And now we're going to go and make the yemista. Menno, we've got the vegetables that you've prepared for us for the yemista. You've got the red peppers and the tomatoes, but I've never seen potatoes before. Yes, Tina, in my village in Greece, we um, actually use potatoes, but you don't just need to use potatoes. You can actually use any type of vegetable. If you can scoop it out, you can fill it. And what are the ingredients we're going to fill it with? Okay, well the ingredients that we have is onions, spring onions, chopped up parsley, chopped up celery. We have uh, also mushrooms, we've got rice, irigany, and finally sweet paprika. Wow, that smells amazing. 
How long has this been cooking for, Menno? Tina, it's been cooking for about 15 to 20 minutes, uh, depending on the, um, uh, on, on the mushrooms. But uh, I've put the majority of the ingredients in there, but I've, got, I've left one ingredient, and that's the main one, the rice. And how do you measure how much rice to put? Measure by the kufta. So you've got, I noticed, 12 vegetables there, so how many kuftas? 12 vegetables, 12 kuftas. How many are we up to? 11, 12. And how long is that going to take? Uh, not long, we just wait until it soaks up all the, um, all the juices and then we're ready to fill it. We're here at the best part of the night again and we've got the yemi star prepared from Menno, absolutely delicious. We've got bread, tzatziki, feta, Greek salad, great company, what else could you want? Now with the red eggs, Despina, tell us a little bit about it. Well the, the red on the eggs symbolises the blood of Christ on the crucifix and the egg itself symbolises fertility and, and life. So. Um, Put it together and I suppose it's about life, fertility and a resurrection and the celebration of life. So um, we play this game called Tsungrisma, we actually Tsungrisi which, and we say Christos Anesti which means um, Christ has risen. And I say Christos Alithos which means truly Christ has risen. That is correct. So Christos Anesti, Alithos Anesti and Kalisa Sorixi, Kali Anastasi. Kalisa Anastasi and Kaliorixi from Tina Sofos from GRTV.